Hello, hello. Welcome, everybody. It's nice to have you one more time. Good evening. Thank you so much for being here. It's my pleasure. I'm gonna have another class here on Zoom. As you may know, today we have Tuesday, October 10th, 2023. Thank you so much for being here. I'm gonna start working on today's class. Thank you so much, everybody, for being here. Okay. Uh, we're gonna have section number four, as you may know, and we're working with our class number 10. So that's the one we're gonna have today. So um, thank you so much for being here. Oh, okay, here we go. Let me show you really quick. Oh yes, there we go. What's What does she look like? Yesterday we started working with appearance uh, and today we're gonna carry on and describing people. And that is the one we're gonna work today. This is pre-intermediate module number two, class number 10. Oh, but he say that, thank you so much. No problem, good evening, nice to have you. Oh, Sandra, okay, Sandra, thank you so much. Good evening, nice to have you, Sandra Noemi Pimentel, welcome. Uh, it's nice to have you all one more time. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Um, yesterday we were working with appearance, right? Um, and um, we're gonna we're gonna use those uh, from um for this class, which is describing people. So we're gonna work with those today. Uh, section number four. What does what does she look like? We're gonna work with describing people today. Okay, so thank you so much everybody for being here. Uh, we're gonna watch a video first. That's the first thing we're gonna do. So I would like to play the video right now. It's just gonna matter so we're gonna have it. Okay. Um, let me see, what is that thing? Okay. Just let me get the attendance ready. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Let's listen and watch. Hi, in this lesson you will learn how to describe, ask and answer questions about appearance. Let's go over the audio program. Notice the questions they use to ask for the information needed. Describing people. General appearance. What does she look like? She's tall with red hair. She's gorgeous. Does he wear glasses? Yes, and he has a beard. Age. How old is she? She's about 32. She's in her 30s. How old is he? He's in his 20s. Height. How tall is she? She's 1 meter 88. She's 6 feet 2. How tall is he? He's quite short. Hair. How long is her hair? It's medium length. What color is his hair? It's dark brown. It's light brown. He has brown hair. When you want to know how someone is physically, we use what look like. For age-related questions, we use how old. For height, we use how tall. The rest of the question will depend on who you're talking about. Pretty much what we have is this one, right? Uh, this thing about describing people. Yes. So uh, let me play the audio so we can have pronunciation first. 
Page 59. Exercise 3. Grammar Focus. Describing People. General Appearance. What does she look like? She's tall with brown hair. She's pretty. Does he wear glasses? No, he wears contacts. Height. How tall is she? She's 1 meter 78. She's 5 foot 10. How tall is he? He's medium height. Hair. How long is her hair? It's pretty short. What color is his hair? It's dark brown. It's light brown. Age. How old is she? She's about 32. She's in her 30s. How old is he? He's in his 20s. Saying Heights. U.S. Tiffany is 5'10". Tiffany is five foot ten. Tiffany is five foot ten inches. Tiffany is five foot ten inches tall. Tiffany is five ten. Metric Tiffany is one meter seventy eight tall. Tiffany is one meter seventy eight. Tiffany is 178 centimeters. Okay, so here we have the information related to the grammar part when it comes to describing people. Yes, yesterday we were working a little bit on this one, and today we're going to get a little bit deep. If you know, we have these typical questions. Oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, se actualizó soon. And that's good for me. Okay. Um, What is this thing? Spotlight. Oh, Jesus. What is this one? Oh, look at this one. Okay. ¿Qué ven la pantalla? Sí. Mm -hmm. Yes. ¿Qué estoy haciendo? Oh, vamos a ver este. Oh, look at this one. Mire. Oh, Jesus, right? Ah, this is good. Magic. Ah, yeah, see, sí. mire, little by little, right? Mire cómo va mejorando. ¿Se acuerda cuando empezamos lo del virtual learning? Allá cuando empezó el COVID. Yes. El, el COVID fue algo, like, difficult, right? Pero mire, pues nos dio esto, right? ¿Qué es? Mire cómo mejorado son. Me está dando auctions aquí. Qué bárbaro son. Very good. ¿Qué más me da? Select, text, draw. Okay, a stamp. Okay, very good. I love it. I love it. Okay, so uh, let's begin here. We have the question. We have some questions. Questions. I love questions in English because it makes us speak. What does she look like? Cuando se refiere a appearance, right? Que usted quiere describir a alguien, right? Physically. Usted pregunta, hey, what does she look like? Or what does he look like? Yes, right? Sometimes, sometimes, uh, hablamos acerca de, pues, de nuestros um, y novias, right? Y en caso de las señoritas, a veces hablan de, pues, de sus novios, right? Entonces vienen, dicen, hey, uh -huh, what does he look like? Le dicen, what does she look like? Yes. Does he wear glasses? Oh, esta question is direct question. Yeah, like with, with yes, no question. Does he wear glasses? Y mire que tenemos contacts. ¿Qué son contacts? Yes. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué son contacts? Exactly. Very good. Right. If, if you, if you like have difficulties with your eyes, like seeing people, sometimes you can wear contacts, but those are expensive, right? Expensive. Hide. 
Mire, how tall is she? Cuando queremos saber la estatura de alguien, oh, we say, how tall is she? Yeah. Y luego tenemos estas, right? Metrics in USA. Normalmente here en El Salvador utilizamos metrics, right? Correct me. Correct me if I'm wrong. Usted me corrige si me equivoco. Metrics is the one that we use here in El Salvador. Yes. Uh, 178 centimeters. 1 meter 78 centimeters. Eso lo ocupamos here in El Salvador. In the U.S. ocupan esto, mire. Pies, right? Yes. Okay, esto con height, con height. Ahora, with hair, mire, how long is her hair? How long is his hair? How long is her hair? What color is her hair? What color is his hair? And with age, la de classic, right? How old is she? How old are you? How old is he? Ahora, como estamos hablando de otra gente, right? Siempre vamos a ocupar how old is she? How old? Is he. And also with age, podemos decir, she's about 32, right? Pues, ahí. Yes. Eh, ya casi cumple, right? Ya casi cumple los 32. And she's in her 20s. Lo que estuvimos hablando yesterday, right? When you would want to say your age, you can say, oh, no, me ando en mis 20s, right? Yeah. Potente, right? Yes. Uh, in my 30s. Yeah, right? I'm good. Yeah, so in my 40s, in my 60s, right? Yeah, right. So this is the way. Yes. Uh, sí, pongan atención a las questions, as you may know. The questions are, are basic. If you see, estamos en intermediate, pero the questions son bien basic. If you see here, mire, tenemos questions, basic questions. Mire, con verb to be. Verb to be is... How long is her hair? What color is his hair? How old is she? How tall is he? How tall is she? What does she look like? So the sentences or the questions are quite simple. Any question about this? Any question about this, people? No questions? Any doubt about this? Mm -hmm. Remember, this is about describing people. So that means, that means, que si usted quiere describir, like, your father, your mother, your son, your daughter, your husband, your wife, I don't know, whoever you want to describe, you need to use this vocabulary, this structure, to talk about somebody, to describe the way he or she looks like. Teacher. Yes, Freddy. Uh, the pronunciation uh, Tiffany is five foot ten inches. Inches. Or, or what, what, what pronunciation? The word inches. Your mic. Oh. Jesus, I apologize. <laughs> I'm sorry, Freddy. Yeah. Inches. Okay. Yeah, that is correct. Ah, that okay. is the way. Perfect. Es pulgada, ¿verdad? Pulgada. Exactly. Ah, okay. Um, okay. Thanks. Fíjese que eso sí que no sé. Um, sí, son pulgadas. Oh, uh, 20, oh, foot. Sí, son pulgadas. Very good. Inches. Inches. This is plural, right? This is plural. Five foot ten inches. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Entonces son cinco pies y... Exactly, right? Exactly. Uh, so that's why, that's why when we buy a product, I don't know, y a veces viene en pulgadas y viene en metrics, right? Si usted se fija, like measure tape, un measure tape, sí, una cinta de medición, un measure tape, viene en USA y viene en metrics. Yes, right. And no sé por qué no se quedan de un solo con esta, because it's easier, <laughs> ok, it's easier, pero por eso vienen así las, 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 um, sometimes, los, um, 
las mediciones, right? So we have it in the US, like inches, right? And and we have it like in matrix, matrix, very good. Metric. Okay, so um, any question about this? No? Okay, let's see. Give me a minute. Oh, I need to I need to close this one. Okay. Page 15. Here we go. A another thing, use have or is to describe eye or hair color. I have brown hair. My hair is brown. Yeah, so you can use both of them. However, si usted tiene que tener cuidado con, pues, cómo va, right? La estructura. He has blue eyes. His eyes are blue. Yes, entonces, en la primera structure, vamos a ocupar have or has. Y en la segunda, vamos a utilizar los possessive adjectives. Yes, right? His eyes are blue. His hair is brown. Okay? Yes. And in the other side, tenemos don't confuse how and what in questions. How tall are you and what color is your hair? Okay, so just be careful with pronunciation here and also with the way we use these two. Yes? Okay. Thank you so much. Vamos a trabajar with this vocabulary here. Ayúdeme, please, Freddy. Read the vocabulary that is in this is chart here. Blonde. Uh, tall and good looking. Uh -huh. Brown eyes. Yes. Six foot. Uh, two. two inches. Two inches. Uh, okay. mm -hmm. <laughs> Contact lens. Lenses. Lenses. Okay. Yes. Uh, 26, two years older than me. Oh, very good. Very good. Entienden? Do you understand this vocabulary? Do you understand this vocabulary, Maria Vilma Cortez Rivas? Hello. Good evening. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Thank yes. you. Oh, perfect. Very good. Si tiene questions, let me know. Okay? Let me know. Perfect. So what are we going to do? We're going to have some questions and then we're going to answer the question, right? What does your brother look like? Entonces, primero vamos a formar una question, right? Yes. Y luego vamos a utilizar one of these vocabulary to answer the question. Yes? Okay, okay. Let's begin with Jorge Mauricio. Number, the next one, letter A. What is the question, um, Jorge? Uh, the the question first. How is how how he uh, six foot two inch? Okay, okay. Let, let's make the question, Jorge. First, let's make the question first. Vamos a hacer la question primero y luego la contestamos. Yes. Okay. How is how he? Oh, how how. Uh huh. How tall? Okay, very good. Is he? Okay. How tall is he? Very good. And what is the answer to this question? Six foot two inch. Okay. Uh, remember that it, we need to write full sentence. So, what is the pronoun? What is the his? Oh, perfect, very good. His, oh, give me a minute. Yes, his is six foot and two inches. Okay, very good. Yeah, correct me if I'm wrong. Oh, I think I did a mistake. Inches, but I think I did a mistake. Just give me a minute. Because I don't inches. remember. Inches. Yes. It begins with I, right? Little, little I. Mm -hmm. Very good. Thank you so much. Perfect. Wonderful. Yes. How tall is he? He's six foot two inches. Very good. Perfect. Okay, Marcos. Oh, thank you, Marcos. The next one is for you. Thank you. Good evening. Nice to have you. 
Dos glasses were he. Excuse me, das. Glasses were he. I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Try one more time. Does he wear glasses? Oh, perfect. Very good. Yes. Does he wear glasses? What is the answer? His contact lens. Oh, okay. Very good. Yes, yes. He, pero le falta aquí algo. Un verb. What is the verb? He is do. No, I'm sorry. He does. He, he, it, it is in the question, Marcos. It is in the question. Does we wear those? He is. Uh -huh. It is in the question. The verb is in the question, Marcos. In the question. He is weird. He is weird. Oh, okay. Very good. He wear or he wears? He wear or he wears? Wear. S or no S? He wears. Oh, very good. He wears? Uh, contact lens. Oh, perfect. Very good. Oops. Contact lens. lenses. Very good. Yes, that is correct. Remember that this is simple present. Okay, mire. ¿Por qué le pedía yo esto? Where's or where? Porque mire, aquí vamos con simple present, right? Recuerde que el simple present, cuando es affirmative, we need to use the grammar word, which is with he, a los verbs, letter S, right? Very good, Marcos. Okay. Great job. Thank you. Uh, okay. Um, Juan, Juan José, thank you. Letter A. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, good evening. Nice to have you. What is color his hair? Oh, I'm sorry, that is incorrect. Try one more time. What is um mm. what color? Oh, very good. There you go. What color is his hair? Perfect. Very good. Great job. Yes. Okay. What is the answer? Um, um, she color, <clears throat> she is color blonde. No. Mm, no, I'm sorry. Try one more time. ¿Se acuerda del cuadrito que les mostré? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, very good. Try one more time with hair. Continue it's, to... oh, okay, continue. It's blonde. Perfect, very good. Okay, yes, it's blonde. Mm -hmm. Just like that. Hay, hay varias okay. formas, right? ¿Se acuerdan que les mostré el cuadrito? Hay varias formas of saying this thing, okay? You can say, oh, his, I don't know, hair is blonde, okay? Like this one, it's blonde. He has blonde hair as well. So different ways, very good. Thank you so much for help us. Evers, Perdomo, thank you. You're next. Good evening, teacher. Thank you, Ever. please. Tell me, what is the question? Okay. okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, does, sorry. That's okay, no problem. Does, you tell me, right? Does he... Does he have blue eyes? Very good. Blue eyes. Blue eyes. Perfect. Does okay. he have blue eyes? Very good. What is the answer? The, the answer is no. He, he is brown eyes. Okay. Brown, so, uh, brown eyes. Okay. So no, he does or he does. He is. 
solamente es solamente el 23%. No, he doesn't. Oh, very good, very good. Thank you so much. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Now, he, you told me. He is. Oh, he is or he has? He has. Oh, very he good. He has brown eyes. Brown eyes. Very good. Perfect. Very good. Thank you. That is correct, okay. right? Wonderful. Thank you so much. Okay. Very good. Daniela, what is another way of saying this? Hi, chair. Um, his eyes are brown. Beautiful. That is correct. Okay. Yes. So, perfect. Thank you so much, the two of you. So, you can say, oh, does he have blue eyes? No, he doesn't, right? He has brown eyes. Or his eyes are brown. Very good. Thank you. Ronald, Rafael. Hello, Ronald. Good evening. Hello, Ronald. Can you participate? Yes or no? Ronald? No, Ronald. Hello, hello. Jose Alcides. Hello, Jose Alcides. Leiva. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Thanks. Oh, that's good. Nice to have you. Puede participar? Uh, me voy conectando, pero... Eh, oh, ok, si con esta explica. palabra que está aquí, esta palabra que está acá, me va a hacer sí. una cuestión y luego, utilizando una de estas palabras, me la va a contestar. Yes. Ok. Ok, perfect. Let's try. Uh, so, what is the question? Uh, all is he. Oh, you see? You got this one. Yeah, easy, right? What is the answer? Uh, uh -huh. What is the answer? Blonde, tall, good looking, uh, brown eyes, six foot, uh, contact lenses, uh, twenty six. Twenty six. Oh, okay. Let's let's make uh -huh. the sentence. Let's make the sentence. Okay. Uh, he he is twenty six. Mm -hmm. Oh, twenty six. Very good. Two so, two years older than me. He's twenty six. Okay. And uh, vamos a dejar hasta ahí. Okay. Okay. Y luego otra sentence, right? Yeah. His um two years older than me. Very good. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Uh, let me see. Jacqueline, question for you. So how old is the other person? He is 26. He is two year, years older than me. So how old are you? I'm 19. No, I mean, based on this oh. sentence, based on this sentence, like, because I'm asking you, oh, how old is he? And your answer is, oh, he's 26. He's two years older than me. So how old are you? That person, right? Uh, no, let's imagine this, this conversation is between you uh, and me, right? Yes. Uh, and, and I ask you, how old is he? And your answer is? I'm 19. No, no, your answer is? He, he has 26. 28. Oh, okay, you're almost there, right? But the, the other sentence is, he's two years. Oh, I'm sorry, let me see. Yes. Oh, so that older. means that she is, uh -huh. she is. 19. <laughs> no, 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 no. I mean, he's 26. It says he's two years older than me. So what is the age of this person? He's 28. Six, six years older. He has 28 years old. <laughs> he is. She, she is she, she's 20. Oh, yes, 24. She, I see this? Yeah, 24. Yeah, somebody said 24. 
Yes, right. No so, dice más viejo. No. Yes, because it's his. Years older es como más viejo, no. Exactly, exactly. That is correct. Entonces tiene 28. No. Siete no, no, años no, más no. viejo. Tiene 24. Mayor que mí. Yes, he has. <laughs> yeah. She, she is 20. Ex no. 21. Just three years. Uh, I got confused. He's five years older. 24. 24 years old. I do. Yes. 24. 24. 24. Oh, what happened with math? Okay. We got lost over there. <laughs> no, this is about. I got confused. Sorry. Yeah, because this person is, is asking about oh, how old is he, right? For example, your husband. Let's imagine, right? How old is your husband? Oh, he is 26. And he's two years old, older than me. No, what about you? How old are you? Yeah, so what is her age, let's say? Yeah, she's 20? 24 years. Exactly, she's 24. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> yeah, that was very good. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, perfect. Okay. Uh -huh. So if you see, it's quite simple, right? We're talking about how tall is somebody. I mean, is this person wears glasses or not? Uh, which which is quite important. What color is his hair or her hair? Pretty much with girls. This one goes with girls, right? Uh, no con boys. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Nowadays everything changes. Uh but uh, with eyes, yeah, maybe that goes with buff. And with how old is oh, this one goes with both of them? I need to take the attendance. So please, when you hear your beautiful name, say prison or I'm here. Thank you so much. Ana Cristina Peña de Paz. Present teacher. Good evening. Nice to have you. Blanca Isolina Guzman Cruz. I'm here. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you. Briseida Janet Garcia de Crespin. Thank you so much for being here. Cindy Stephanie. Ramirez Rodriguez. Present teacher. Thank you so much and welcome. Good evening. Claudia Yesenia Flores de Galdames. I'm here. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Daniela Mercedes Olivares Racinos. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. Good evening. Evers Ernesto Perdomo Álvarez. Hello. Present. Thank you, Evers. It's nice to have you. Edith Carolina Rivera de Segundo. I'm here, teacher. Thank you so much. Good evening. Edwin Benjamin Sanchez Portillo. Hello, Edwin. Are you here? Let me check if Edwin is here. Edwin, no, he isn't. Okay. Uh, let's carry on with Elisa Maria Garcia de Ruiz. Present, teacher. Thank you so much. Welcome. Uh, Freddy Alberto Paz Carrillo. Present teacher. Good evening. Eliana Mariel Alvarado Menjivar. You're here, right? Yes. Thank you so much for being here. I appreciate that. Okay, Eliana. Thank you. Um, um Jacqueline Vanessa Rodriguez Sanchez. Hello, Jacqueline. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Uh, Janessi Alexandra Lopez Portillo. Present. Good evening. It's nice to have you. Jean Lisette Escobar Lucero. Present teacher. Thank you, Jean. Welcome. Jorge Mauricio Gutierrez Alfaro. Present. Thank you so much. Jose Alcides Ala Leiva Ibarra. Present teacher. Thank you so much. Um, Jocelyn Tatiana Moreno Mercado. Come here, teacher. Wonderful. Nice to have you. Juan Jose Garcia Mendez. Present, teacher. Thank you so much, Juan. Liliana del Tránsito Aguilar Juárez. Liliana del Tránsito Aguilar Juárez. Let me see if Liliana is here. Okay. Lili. No, she isn't here. No, okay. So she is in uh, Marcos Alberto Palacios Herrera. Present, good, good evening. evening. Welcome, Maria Vilma Cortez Rivas. Maria Vilma Cortez Rivas. Present. Thank you so much. Good evening, uh, Milena de Los Angeles Aragón Pleites. 
Milena de los, oh, let me check if Milena is here really quick. Uh, Milena, okie dokie, let me see. Oh, thank you, Milena. It's nice to have you. Good evening. Um, Rona Rafael Cruz Amaya. Sandra Noemi Pimentel Álvarez. Thank you so much, Sandra. Santos Guadalupe Ruiz Ventura. I'm here. Thank you so much. Tiffany Guadalupe Martinez Mendez. Present. Thank you so much. Good evening. Jenny Lisbeth Tolosa Cortez. Present teacher. Thank you. And Jenny Marisol Hernandez de Guevara. Present teacher. Thank you so much. It's nice to have you. I love you. Let me check something really quick here. Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. This one, no. Oh, okay. Okay, thank you so much. Let's get back to the presentation really quick. Um, again, we're working with describing people. That's what we're doing here. Okay. Um, now here we have more information about describing people. If you see, we have some vocabulary here. Okay. Ayúdeme, please, Jenny Marisol Hernández de Guevara. Ayúdeme a leer this one. A B. Okay. A B. Jenny. Okay, teach. Medium, fairly, good, middle, dark, eight, brown, eggs, eye, long, eye, long looking, medium, eight. Medium height, very good. Medium. Okay, pues vamos a utilizar este vocabulary to make here. I don't know. Compound words. Okay. Let's begin with the number two. What is the number two? Anybody? Um, anybody? Fairly. What is this one? Fairly. Uh huh. What is next? Fairly. Excuse me. Fairly. Excuse me. Fairly short. Fairly short. Uh, but we don't have it here. No lo tenemos aquí. Yeah. Fairly brown. Fairly brown. Okay. Say. Uh. Good looking. Fairly okay, long. Fairly long. Okay, vamos a dejarlo así. Fairly long. Number three, you tell me good looking, right? Oh. Good. Uh, looking, okay. What about number four? Middle? Dark brown. Middle? Age. Middle age. Middle age. Exactly. And the other one is dark? Brown. Brown, okay. In that one, okay. Yeah, I think that is the way, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. Dark brown. La tres. Mm -hmm. La cuatro, como que está. Good looking. Good looking. Mm -hmm. Okay, you say, what color is his hair? El cabello. Uh-huh. What this is, like, answer the question, use the description from part A. So, what, <clears throat> what does he look like? What color is his hair? How long is his hair? How old is he? Okay. Liliana, thank you. Teacher, yo creo que ya pasó la asistencia. Es que justamente en ese momento me sacó de la plataforma que se me fue la cobertura y no, no pude decir presente. Oh, no problem. Ok, ahorita. Liliana del Tánsito, right? Sí, sí. Ok, ok. Thank you. Gracias, teacher. No problem. Thank you so much. Siempre que hay un inconveniente así, así como lo hizo ella, right? Let me. 
Ok. Entonces, so, ¿cuál sería la number two? What does she look like? Mm -hmm. ¿Cuál sería la answer? What does she look like? Good looking. It is oh. a good looking. Oh, She's very good. good. She is very good. Perfect. She's good looking, right? Or he. Oh, oh, let me see. He's the chair. Oh, yes, right. Oops. Oh, because he's the guy in the picture. Oh, Jesus. That's why. Okay. <laughs> Just a little mistake, right? He's the guy in the picture. Oh, okay. <laughs> now I realized. Okay. So he's good looking. Okay. Good looking. Okay, perfect. Let me write the period at the end. Very good. What about number three? What color is his hair? He has dark brown. Oh, okay. He... Okay, he has. Oh, come on. He has. Teacher, y, y good looking, más separado o así unido? Oh, that's a good question. Ah, no me acuerdo. He is good looking. Creo que va separado, right? Yo creo que sí va separado. Ahorita lo corrijo. Okay, so solo aquí tenemos. He has dark brown. Hair. Excuse me. Hair. Okay. Hair. Very good. Here, very good. Thank you so much. He has dark brown hair. Oh, Jesus, I did something wrong here. Okay, here we go. Thank you so much, Anna. That's very nice of you. Yeah. Uh, he's, you tell me, he's good looking. Oh, my gosh. He's good looking. Yeah, there you go. Very good. What about number four? What if we have a number four? How long is his he's hair? Perfect. He's huh? fairly short. He's fairly oh. long. Oh, he's, he's fairly short. hair, very good. He's fairly, so, oh, Jesus. Fairly long. Oh, it's fairly long. Okay. Why long? Because, mira, aquí tenemos, right? No tenemos short. Okay. His hair is fairly long. Very good. Thank you so much. What about the number five? How old is he? Oh, okay. Perfect. He's middle age. Oh, geez. Oh, I'm sorry. He's middle age. Oh, yeah. Perfect, right? Any question about this? So, if you see, mire, de una, de una picture, nos pasamos, how tall is he? Um, how does he look like? Also, we can say um, things like, how long is his hair? And how old is he? Also, if you notice, aquí no le dijimos, right, specifically about it so we we were saying like random information like his age how old is he so mire no dije exactly his age right yeah so we can use different vocabulary to communicate uh how old is this person without saying the exact i don't know number you know what i mean yes so we can say oh he's middle age so you can figure it out that one oh fairly long yeah Thank you so much. Thank you. Okay, let's continue. Now, this is about you. Describe yourself, and you need to answer this question. How old are you? What do you look like? What are you wearing today? Yes? Les voy a dar exactamente five minutes to do this in your notebook, in your beautiful notebook, right? Yes? Uh, in your beautiful notebook, write this description about yourself. Okay, what do you need to answer? First of all, right, you can start by saying your name. Hello, my name is Ana Cristina. I am, right? You, you say your age. What do you, I'm sorry, what do you look like? Yeah, what do you look like? And then what are you wearing today? Well, I'm wearing t-shirt and wearing glasses i don't know and wearing i don't know flip-flops and all those things yes do you understand edith carolina do you understand 
Yes, sir. Yes, teacher. Beautiful. Very good. Good. Okay, so five minutes to do this one. Y luego empiezo a pedir participation on this one. Okay. Yes, Claudia. Yes, teacher. Wonderful. Thank you so much. If you have a question about this thing, let me know anytime so I can help you out. Okay. Okay, Ronald. Thank you so much for letting me know. Thank you. Uh, okay, so you're making money, right? A lot of money. Yeah. <laughs> extra hours i hope they they pay you extra right if you work like late i hope they pay you extra okay yeah i, ho I hope that i hope that so you can you can get extra money remember that christmas is coming so you need to buy el how do you say that one el estreno right yeah you need to buy el estreno right so you need to make money right so if you're doing extra hours well that's that's good for you yeah, so you can uh, you can go downtown, buy al centro y compre, right? El estreno ahí, right? Yeah. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, very good. Oh, let me see. <laughs> no, because I remember when, when I was little, okay, y, y siempre mi mamá me compraba el estreno, right? <laughs> y siempre lo quemaba with, with a bunch of cuetes en silvadores. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I used to damage my 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 estreno. Yeah, so that's why I'm laughing. Oh, porque quemaba el estreno, right? Okay, Liliana, thank you. Uh -huh. Liliana, yes. Está hablando. Es que no, no se le escucha a Liliana. Sí, no se le escucha a Liliana. No, no le escucho. Ah, no que se... la se... Ahora uh -huh. sí. Yes, yes, very good. La segunda pregunta es cómo te ves, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. yes. ¿Te refiere en cuanto a personalidad? No, appearance, okay. appearance. Yes, okay, appearance. Uh -huh. ah, ¿Se acuerda que yesterday había una tablita con, con pictures, right? Creo que la mandaron al grupo. Yes, en WhatsApp. Ahí está con appearance. Habrían, habrían como, I don't know, like three options, I guess. Uh, to communicate the way you the look. Right. What do you look like? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What do you look like? Yes. Oh, Janessi. Hello, Janessi Alexandra. Hello. Do you understand the activity? Yes. Oh, perfect. Very good. What about you, Juan? Hello, Juan. Good evening. One and yeah. you. Oh, oh, perfect. Okay. If you have a question, let me know anytime. Yep. This is about describing yourself. Sometimes it's hard to describe ourselves, right? Yes. A veces cuesta describirnos, right? Uh, like ourselves. Sometimes it's tough. Um, I don't know. Sometimes cuando tienen las capacitaciones, right? Ahí les, les hacen este tipo de activities. Oh, descríbase usted en un adjetivo. O oh, descríbase usted, right, in, I don't know, in one sentence. O oh, let's say, describe yourself in an animal. Let's pick an animal and... <laughs> oh, my gosh. And, and I don't know, that represents the way you are, let's say. Yeah. So when we have these kind of seminars, they usually, they say us. They they tell us right these kind of things that we that we need to do in order to describe ourselves. Or oh, a veces nos pasan like una encuesta right con different characteristics. Y le dice ah no pero es que usted es like una persona que se enoja rápido. I don't know you get mad really easy, or you are a, a calm person, or you are like I don't know a happy person right a friendly person. Um, yeah, those those kind of things right. Okay. Ana, Cristina, Peña, are you ready? Yes. Hello. Good evening. How are you? Okay. ¿En cuál? Are you ready? ¿De cuál de las preguntas? De la última. Oh, no, What todo, are todas. Are you wearing today? Todas. Uh, all. Desde el principio. Es como que usted se va a presentar. Hello. Good evening, everybody. My okay. name is Anna. 
Okay. Hello. Good evening. My name is Ana Cristina. Um, I am is all uh, victims. Um, very good. Relax. Um, T-shirt, pants. Um, um, uh, sola, solamente. Okay, Ana. Very good. Very good. Great job. You got, you got the idea. Si le falta unos detalles. For example, Ana. Okay. Entonces, uh, how old are you? ¿Cómo dice? Uh, ¿Cómo contesta esta cuestión? How old are you? Um, how old are you? Ajá. Uh -huh. Si yo le pregunto I usted. I am is. Okay. Give me a minute. Me dijo I. I am. Is. Is. All. Like this, así me dijo. Sí. Ok, perfect. Ahí está incorrecto porque tiene dos verbs to be. Entonces, ¿cuál verb to be va con este pronoun? De estos dos. Um. Exacto. Entonces, esto lo elimino, right? Yes. Sí. Y aquí me falta el number, Ana. O sí. algo relacionado al age. You know what I mean? Yes. ¿Sí? 50. Ok, very good. 50. O si usted no quiere decir su fecha, right? Pues su nombre, right? Puede decir middle, age, if you want to. Yes, right? If, if you don't want to be specific about it. Usted puede decir, oh, middle age. Ok. Yes, solo, okay. igual, no se le olvide esto aquí en, en the middle. Ok. Uh, Um, what do you look like? En este es appearance, right? Vamos a ocupar siempre el verb to be, Ana. ¿Cómo me dijo usted? Excuse me. Le dije very good. Exactly, right. En este caso siempre usted me está diciendo que está bien, right? Entonces la pregunta es, what do you look like? Cuando tenemos look like is about appearance, right? Yes. Entonces, right? Si, si no me puede decir very good, porque very good es otro contexto, va right? something else. Okay, entonces aquí yo le estoy preguntando cómo, pues, um, se ve usted. Yes, right. ¿Cuál es su apariencia física? Yes, entonces vamos siempre con el verb to be. I, ¿cuál es el verb to be para I? Um, very good. Um, I am. Yeah. I am beautiful. Yes, right? I am, I don't know. Uh, let me see, pretty. Okay. Yes. I am good looking. Okay. Yes. yes. Right? Ahora, a esto también usted le puede agregar different things. Por ejemplo, I am tall, yes. Um, let me see what else. Mm -hmm. Yes, like this one, I am tall. Y en la última, what are you wearing today? Siempre vamos con I am, oh, I'm sorry, wearing. Vamos a utilizar el verbo wearing porque se refiere a vestir, right? Okay, I am wearing, y luego el vocabulary que me dijo. ¿Cuál fue el vocabulary? T-shirt. Okay. ¿Qué más? Pan, pen. Pants. Oh. Very good. Pants. ¿Cómo se llaman estas cosas? Yeah. Yes, mm, the glasses. Very good. Okay. And glasses, right? Yeah. So, mire, I see, right? This is the way we're going to do it. Okay, so siempre with full sentences, right? I am middle age. Aquí si pone middle age, ya no me ocupa all, right? You don't need to use your. I am beautiful. I am pretty. I am good looking. I am tall. Yes. I am wearing t shirt or oh, a t shirt, I'm sorry. Pants and glasses. So siempre va a ir full. I am, I am, he is, she is, and so on and so on, right? 
no es como en Spanish, que en Spanish tenemos que decir, oh, eh, lo, no, omitimos esto, right? Esto que está acá lo omitimos en Spanish. But in English, no, we need to say it. We need to say it. Ok, salvo que sea así como lo hizo usted aquí, mire. Aquí usted me dio three options de un solo, right? I am wearing, porque el verbo me lo permite. Yes. El verbo me da la chance. Oh, I am wearing a t-shirt, pants, and glasses. Bien. Yeah. Bien, yeah. so. Very good, Ana. Great job. Thank you. Vamos a preguntarle. Ah, let me see. Oh, thank you, Juan José. Go ahead. Yeah, good evening, everyone. Uh, my name is Juan Garcia. I'm 27 years old. I have long and hairy hair. I'm one meter and 70 centimeters tall. And I have a lot of tattoo. Uh, today, uh, today I'm wearing uh, a short and t-shirt and hat and jeans <laughs> flip flops yeah flip flops yeah yeah perfect one everything is awesome great job okay yeah in it, it, it is quite simple if you notice the description about himself is quite simple yeah not not, not a lot of information about very good okay oh, somebody okay. else wants to um um, say it. Somebody else, raise your hand. Thank you so much. Oh, yeah, right. Uh huh. Thank you, Claudia. Go ahead. Hey, good evening. My name is Claudia Flores. I'm in my 30s. I am fairly short. I have black, straight hair. I am one meter fifty eight inches height. I'm wearing a pink blouse and a white and blue shirt. Beautiful. Everything is perfect, Claudia. Great job. Thank you. Great job, Jacqueline Vanessa Rodriguez. Thank you. Um hi everybody. Um my name is Jacqueline Vanessa, um, I'm 19 years old, and, and I am a person who is fairly short, and I have uh, long brown hair, and very long, <laughs> and, and I am wearing a crop top and a brown shirt, and just that. Thank you so much. That's why you were saying 19, right? Because of your age. Oh, okay. Now I understand. Thank you so much. That was a very good. Great job. Thank you so much. Let me see. Uh, Edith, Carolina. Thank you. Okay. Good evening. Um, my name is Edith. I am about 22. Um, I am pretty. I'm wearing a dress and flip flops. Flip flops, very good, very good. Straight to the point, Edith, and quite simple. I love it. Great job. Okay, great job. Okay. Yeah. So this is the way you can practice. And my suggestion is practice at home. Yes. Describe as you stay right, and also describe your wife, describe your husband, or I don't know your mother or your father. Or your daughter, right? Hacer que si le diga, oh, you are beautiful. You are wearing. You are tall. Okay? So use this, uh, they say adjectives to describe people um, at home as well. So you can practice. Hey, Marcos, thank you. Go ahead. Hello, good evening. I introduce myself. My name is Marcos Palacios. I am middle-aged. 22 years old. I am looking good looking. I'm pretty tall. I have black hair and straight. I am wearing a t-shirt, glasses, jeans, and boots. Thank you so much. Very good. Just with middle age. I see tengo una because you did you told me 22, right? Correct me if I'm wrong. 
Yes, yes. Pero middle age, uh, age, age number. I don't know what's the number. Um, I don't know. Do you know what's the number with middle age? Yeah, it's, it's between 40 and 50. Ok, Marcos, it's between 40 years and, 50, and 60. Por eso yo le comentaba a otra compañera, right? Here, for example, aquí sí le puse middle age, por eso. Because I got 50. Entonces, cuando escuché 22, I was like, oh, ok. So, I, I got confused. You know what I mean? La palabra middle age, porque usted mencionó middle age, yes? Corrígeme si me equivoco. Yes, yes. Entonces, middle age es cuando una persona tiene between 40 and 60 years. Ok? So, oh, there is what okay. we use. Okay, um, thank you so much for your participation on this one. As I told you before, use this vocabulary to describe your relatives at home, okay? Or your, or even your co-workers or your, I don't know, your siblings, okay? Thank you so much for being here. Good night, everybody. See you tomorrow. Yeah. Take care. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night. Thank you. Thank you. Good night. Great job, everybody.